and we're back with our informational text, our farm animals. Boys and girls, before we get started, I'd like to correct something that I neglected to do when we had our greeting circle. I want to say a special hello to my nephew, Dorian. Dorian watches my videos faithfully. He gets up in the morning and he says, Mommy, can I watch what Auntie has posted today? So good morning, Dorian. I miss you. Farm animals. Remember, guys, this is the, the front cover of our book. This is the back of our book. This is the spine of our book that holds it all together. This is an informational book. It's not a story book. And it has a table of contents, as we talked about the other day. Look at that pig. That's the animal that we're talking about today. That big old pig. And here's our table of contents. Remember, the number tells us what page that we go to to look for the specific animal. Now, in this table of contents, it says hogs. We talked about that. Hogs is another word that we can use for a big pig. Can you see the number across from the word hogs? Hogs is spelled H. O G S. Can you find that word? There it is. You're right. Hogs. So if we slide our finger over, we see that hogs, we can find out about hogs on page 14. 14. All right, so let's turn to page 14. And here we are. Oh my goodness, look at that big fat hog. Looks like he's lying in a muddy puddle. Hmm, that's a big one hogs. Farmers raise hogs for their meat. Bacon and ham are two of the meat products from hogs. Farmers raise hogs in pens, either indoors or outdoors. Pigs outdoors like to stay in mud. They like to stay in mud pools. They also like to poke their snouts into soil to find food. Hogs eat mostly corn and grain as most farm animals do. I heard a couple words that I'd like to go back to. Snouts. This sentence says, they also like to poke their snouts into soil to find food. Let's talk about this word, snouts snouts. Do you know what that means? Some say yes, some say no. A snout is this right here. That's the pig's nose. We call it a snout. Snout. Isn't that a funny word? Say it. Snout. Mm-hmm. When we say snout, what sound do we hear at the beginning? S, s. Letter S makes that sound, right? The other word that I want to draw your attention to today, it also begins with that sound. S. Soil. 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 Boys and girls, do you remember what that word means? Soil? Soil is another name for dirt. That's right, you guessed it. Soil is another name for dirt. Let's read it. Soil, soil, soil. A farmer really has to take care of the soil 
on the farm when he's growing his vegetables and taking care of his animals. If the soil is not healthy, the vegetables and fruits that the farmers grow, they won't be healthy either. If the soil is not healthy, the animals won't be healthy either. So that's another job that the farmer must do on the farm. So today we learned about hogs. A hog is a big what? That's right, it's a big pig. All right, so pig begins with what letter? The letter P. Pig, let's spell pig. P-I-G. Let's spell it again, P-I-G. So let's do some thinking today. Let's think about what other words we can come up with that rhyme with the word pig. Remember, rhyming words are words that sound the same at the end, but they begin with different, sound, different letters and different sounds. So here's our word pig, but let's think about some words that rhymes with the word pig. All right, so I'm gonna write. I'm gonna write pig down here and we'll put the rhyming words underneath. Pig, how do we spell pig again? P I G. There it is, pig. Are you thinking? Let's activate our thinking powers. Thinking powers activate. You got it? J, J, J. What letter makes that sound? Letter J, right? Let's see what happens when we put J in front of the I and the G. J, I, G. There it is, J, I, G. Let's sound out pig. P, egg, P, egg. You hear all the sounds? G. And when we put them together, we get pig, pig. So let's sound out this one. J, e, g, j, e, g. Let's turtle read it. J, e, g, j, e, g. What's that word? Jig. Jig, you got it. What if we put a W here in front of the I and the G? Are you thinking what word that might be? All right, I'm gonna write it. All right, let's spell it. W-I-G. You ready? Let's spell it again. W-I-G. Let's sound it out. W-I-G. Let's do it again. W-I-G. Let's turtle read it. W-I-G. W Egg. What's that word? Wig. Wig. That's right. It's wig. All right. So let's read the three rhyming words. P. Egg. Pig. J. Egg. Jig. 
W, egg, wig. Pig, jig, wig are rhyming words. Can you think of some more words that rhyme with pig? Now they don't all have to be words that make sense. They can be some nonsense words. When you put different letters at the beginning of ig, you can come up with your own rhyming word. So as you make your comments today, boys and girls, tell me what other words that you can come up with that rhymes with pig. Remember, it can be a nonsense word. It can be vig or Ooh, what, 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 what? I can't even think. Oh, kig. That's a nonsense word, right? But there's some real words and there's nonsense words that you can come up with. So that's going to be part of your assignments today. You will tell me a word or words that you can think of that rhymes with pig. All right, before we go, let's sound them out one more time. P-ig, pig. J ig jig w ig wig. All right, guys. See you later. Wishing you well.